photos have been released by the Department of Public Safety. They show the faces of seven of the nine people the state says instigated a riot at the border last month. That's the same riot that led to the arrest of more than 200 migrants. KTSM 9 News reporter Oriana Botaro is live at Gate 36 in El Paso with more on who these men are. Oriana. Good afternoon, Estella. All nine individuals are facing felony charges, and seven of those are being held in custody in the El Paso County Jail. Their arrests are all part of a larger effort to find those that were involved in the chaos that unfolded here in Gate 36 on March 21st, when a group of illegal immigrants attempted to breach the concertina wire and enter the United States illegally. These are the photos released by DPS showing the seven men currently being held. Their ages range from 18 to 46. They all come from several different countries and DPS says they are searching for two other men that would also face felony charges once arrested. Now, just yesterday, El Paso District Attorney Bill Hicks held a press conference where he said about 1,000 migrants gathered at the riverbanks on March 21st and that a group of 425 pushed through the barriers placed by the soldiers and into the guards themselves. More than 200 are currently being held at the El Paso County Jail and surrounding facilities on misdemeanor charges. So those arrests have recently raised concerns over overcrowding and however, once released, those individuals will be turned over to ICE. And over the weekend, Judge Humberto Acosta approved the release of of those detainees, not including the ones that are facing felony charges. This continues to be a developing story. Stay with KTSM on air and online for the latest. Reporting in the U.S.-Mexico border, Oriana Botaro, KTSM 9 News.